Okay, so coming from the outside, walk it in. That goes upstairs. And then into this beautiful space. There's the kitchen. And then to the left is this, I guess it's a living room with French doors to the yard. Yeah. Now, this room used to be a sunroom before it was uh, rehabbed and it leaked so it had glass ceilings and glass walls and they've completely redone it. Really cute space now. It's got the original brick floors from when it was a sunroom though. Really nice. The tongue and groove ceilings. So pretty. A lot of the brick walls, the arched doorways. So, and you can see it goes right through back to the kitchen here. So, there's the kitchen. I hope I'm not making you dizzy. Got marble counters there and here. It's a, an electric fireplace. And then right into the dining room. And you can see that they really opened this up. They still have some of the original features, the built-in. See, there's they've opened up both sides of the fireplace into the kitchen. The fireplace is really pretty. And it's got the tongue and groove ceilings again. vinyl replacement windows that's the convent next door p.s so and then the living room over here wood floors the original wood floors Pocket doors, French doors. Again, looking back out to the kitchen. And then we have a bathroom here. Oh, back to the kitchen. Bathroom here. Nice tile work. Again, the, the ceilings. I bet this had plaster ceilings. That's why they did these tongue and groove. And then I'm turning around showing you the dining room again. And then there's just this little sitting room. Amanda, here's your, your reading spot. A room. And then the original entry. Back to the other side of the living room again see the dining room upstairs we'll go up there in a minute the entryway so that's Kapisic Street you're seeing you need to shut this entryway right off oh what did I miss for a room so off this little room right here. Oh, there's a bedroom. This is a first floor bedroom. First floor bedroom with a fireplace. Nice. Okay. I'm going to turn this off before I go upstairs.